hello guys welcome back today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make some settings on your Facebook stories so um, in order for you to make your stories more customized and more personal you have to do some settings in order to do that so go ahead and open your Facebook now to go to the story settings area all you need to do is click on this menu icon right here scroll down to the bottom hand corner on the second to the last option go ahead and click on it and then next to it you click on the setting area and then you scroll down to the section that says um stories although we could actually search it up there but i just want you guys to see so go ahead and click on the stories privacy and from here you can select some settings like you can see it's set to friends and connections on default but for some reason for this tutorial, I'm going to make it public so that you guys can understand some things. So once you make it public, that means everybody gets to see this particular um, story whenever you make post on your stories. But if you set on this second option that says um, your friends and connection, then it's only displays to your friends and connection. And if you look at the bottom hand area, you can notice this other option that says hide stories from. So you can actually select um, some specific people you can hide the story from so if it's for some reason you want to hide the story from this person and you don't want the person to see the story you can go ahead and select it and if you want more option you can select them and if the names are not showing here probably it's below you can just click here and then search for that particular name and it's going to come up and you can select them so once you're done you just back out so automatically it's going to you can see below it have selected these people to hide your stories from them so but um this is just a tutorial base so i'm going to go ahead and uncheck all this but if you need them you can just set them by yourself and I'm just going to go ahead and back out so we are just going to um check out this other one under the friends area it also have the same option which you can still hide your story from some specific people so you can click on this area and still select the people you want to hide your stories from them and then below it you get to see the custom option where you get to select um the specific people who will actually view your stories now if you select these people they are the only one that will be able to see your stories once you post them but i don't really think this is relevant since you already know your post is going to be viewed and but if you want some post you can just make it custom so you just select a specific people that view them and then back out once you've back out you've saved them so now we are done with this other area so let's go back and let me show you the next option i actually forgot to make it public i always forget this so now um the next option is your sharing option now when you click on this it gives you privilege to select who actually will be able to share your story on their timeline on on their stories i mean so go ahead and click on this in order to select who sees your stories so now once you selected this particular option you can notice from here it um it allows it allows people to be able to share your story so you can see anyone um you can just turn this to public that anyone will be able to share your story what it means is once you post a story on your stories area anybody that sees your story will be able to share your story onto their own stories so um if you say no that means um you won't be allowing people to share your stories on their own story area so it actually um turns that particular um features off so now on this bottom area you could actually allow people what the second option does what the second option does is to give privilege to people who you actually mention on your story for instance if you posted a picture of your friends and then you mention them on there so now um what this option says is, is either you allow them to be able to share your own story on their own profile or you can just say no you do not want to allow them to share your story even though you've mentioned them on your timeline so it just depends on the way you want to leave this you can either turn it on on off but i prefer it to be off so i do not allow it to be shared whenever they see the story even though i mentioned them so let's go ahead and back out and let me show you the other option now on this um archive area i've showed you on the previous video once this is on view that means it's turned on 
So if this is turned on, after your story disappears within 48 hours of posting it, it's, it's going to be saved on your archived area. There is an area called an archive which I showed you guys how to view. So you can check my other video in order to see how to view your archive or you can check on the description below. I'm going to leave a comment on the description below on how to check how to view your archive so you can watch the video and see how to recover your um, pictures or your stories on your archive. Now let's go back. So the next one on your highlight area, now you can decide on, you can decide either the public views your highlight or it's only your friends that views them or you can also select to custom people who views them. If you select friends, that means you are going to limit it to only your friends that will be able to be able to see your highlight but I, I wonder why you go only limited to your friends this is a highlight and then you can also select this option to hide who checks your highlight but for some reason i'm not going to select anybody because i'm still going to change this back on and still like the previous one you can still customize people that will be able to see your highlight so now um i'm just going to leave this on public because i prefer it to be on public on default but for some reason you can just change this to whatever you want now um okay back out so now you can now the last thing on our previous video we muted some people so to unmute some people on this video all you need to do is to just go ahead and click and then you can see that it unmutes these people so once you unmute then you you start seeing their video and once you back out it's going to update later on you can notice now there is um you haven't muted anybody yet so if you do not mute anybody that means they will show here so the reason why they are not displaying here anymore is because i've unmuted them it's just like accepting and declining a friend request accepting and canceling a friend request so it's pretty easy and that is how to um work on your facebook stories and hopefully i hope you guys understand this video and enjoyed it please do a uh, like and comment if you if you have some question and Please share the video with your friends if it was helpful. And also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm TS Tech Talk. And I'll be making some more video for you guys. See you guys soon.